Good afternoon, Amanda and Shanka. I'm just doing a quick video tour for you guys on the 2012 Honda Accord that you've inquired on. Um, so in these video tours, um, obviously you guys are a little bit further away from uh, the dealership and you're not able to make it in for, for your own reasons, obviously. Um, just thought I'd do this for you so you can actually see the condition of the car. In these videos, what I'll do is I'll, I'll go through, I'll point out any scratches, dints, any signs of aging whatsoever um, and try to show you on the camera exactly where these things are if there is any. Um, so as I've come around the front there you can see there isn't any scratches of stone chips there. Um, all the wheels are in good nick. Um, there's heaps of tread on them. You can see the tint as they come along the side there. There's no bubbles or scratches or anything like that in it. Um, the car presents incredibly well. Uh, I'm sure you can see just with the reflection on the paint how clear the reflection actually is against the car. So as I come along the side and show you the doors and everything like that, I'll come back along uh, on the back end and just show you there's that rear tire there as well. So obviously this side of the car is all, always going to be prone to more gutter rash on the wheels, uh, but you can see there is none on this one. Um, and as I come along here, you can see that reflection again, but you'll also see if there was any imperfections in the panel work, so dints or shopping centre dings, anything like that, it would actually reflect quite, uh, quite visibly on camera. Uh, which I'm hoping the camera's doing a good enough job, I'm using an iPad, so <laughs> if it's not, forgive me. Um, as I come along the back, you'll see obviously you've got your sensors uh, along the car, but the boot and all the paint and everything like that, there's no paint missing around any of the four corners of the car. There's no sun damage whatsoever on the, on the bonnet, uh, sorry, on the boot. Uh, especially on the roof, which I'll definitely show you. So you can see there even the reflection on the roof, like the paint's in, in very good condition. Um, yes, it is only a 2012 model car. You wouldn't expect to see anything. Um, however, it's always good to just get that, get that glance over and get the angles right. Same on this side. Um, yeah, it's all in very, very, very good condition on the outside, as well as the outside, which I'll show you now. So open up the back, so you can see the condition of this leather feet in the back. You've got your anchor points at the back there. Uh, Shankar, I believe you did tell me, yes, uh, you were wanting three anchor points in the back. So you can see there, there's the middle one, there's the second one, and here's the third one. And they are really, really comfortable to sit in and to drive. Just come along there and show you the door as well, so you can see there's no marks or anything on the door. There's no... Back seats are all looking very good as well and I'll jump inside as well and just show you you've got carpet mats throughout show you the driver's door there so no real signs of aging whatsoever a little bit here but honestly it's it's me being picky I guess uh, but obviously I want to present it as best as I can for you so you can see it all a little bit of dirt on the seats there it does need a bit of a vacuum and clean yeah, a little bit of a mark there on the driver's seat. It's coming out though, so it must be just a bit of dirt. Um, and all your seat, oh, oh yeah, sorry, your floor mats and everything like that are in the car. And I'll just step in the car now. Um, and I'll just show you the dash as well. Some people have dash mats on the, on the, on the dash and it does leave that sort of adhesive sticky stuff um, that they use to stick it down on. This obviously hasn't had it. There's no marks or evidence of it. Um, yeah, very clean, very tidy, been kept very, very well. So all your air conditioning controls, um, your CD player, radio, all of that. Um, you can see up there, it's got all the information for you. Um, so your air conditioning, what you've got it set at, the, the control or the, the direction of the fan, uh, the speed of the fan, I've turned it down obviously because I didn't want it interrupting. Um, all your heated seats things, not that we really need it here in Queensland, but but, you know, some winter mornings can be a little bit nippy. Um, and everything else there. Just lift that up for you so you can see in there. It's all clean and no damage or anything like that. So, yeah, your gear shifter, all of that. As well as, you can lift this up as well. You've got your auxiliary and USB for the uh, your entertainment. As well as, um, you've got... The aftermarket Bluetooth system, 
which is pretty good. Um, obviously, there's no visual controls. It's all pretty much on your phone. Uh, very easy to set up. You push one button, it comes up on your phone saying yes. Add it to it. You add it. It's fine. <laughs> um, and then you've got here your updated Ks. So you can see there's no other lights on the on the car. Obviously, I've got to go get fuel for it at some stage, but uh, worry about that later. You've got your handbrake light, the seat belt light, and your door light at the top right, as well as it's in park. So there's no engine lights or you know sensors or anything emitting from the car. Um, it is mechanically sound. It's in very very good condition. Your roof works as well. It's automatic. You push it once and it opens up, and then you just push it one more time. And away you go. Lovely. All right. Well, I right, shall so we'll just jump out now. And uh, that that concludes the video tour uh, on the car, guys. I hope it does clarify the condition of it, and it's you know going to make it or assist you in making a decision. Um, obviously, every used car is going to be different. It's going to have a different life um, and a different owner. So previous owner has taken very good condition of it um, if you want to secure the car with me subject to actually coming in and test driving and viewing that is something we facilitate here um, so you have my numbers um, just give me a buzz uh, I'll send this off and we'll talk later all right guys thank you again for your inquiry I look forward to hearing from you Bye.